We are looking at the 2021 Hyundai Elantra N-Line in intense blue. Guys, they put a turbo in the Elantra. Probably never thought you would have seen that. It has a 1.6 liter four cylinder engine and it can be paired with a six speed manual, which is what we have here, or a seven speed automatic transmission. Super duper love that they made that an option. It's front wheel drive. It gets about 201 horsepower, 195 pound feet of torque. And of course, depending on your driving habits, you'll get about 25 in the city and 34 on the highway. Remember that the N line is different than the N. The N line is a trim that is available on several of Hyundai's vehicles, and the N is a more track ready vehicle. This one is mostly aesthetic upgrades. So, some of those upgrades that make this Elantra stand out compared to the others in the lineup are the entire front bumper. You get a glossy black bumper with an N line badge right in there. You also get projector headlights, LED daytime running lights, and you you also get different wheels. You have 18 inch alloy wheels that have this kind of cool serrated knife design to them. And you also get a, another N-Line badge right there on your fender. You also get gloss black window trim all the way around both front and back windows and a glossy black C pillar design here as well. And you do get a sunroof on the N-Line around the back. You'll get LED tail lights as well as a chrome tipped dual outlet exhaust. And not to mention this black spoiler on the back makes it look extra sporty. Opening the trunk is really nice. I like how they designed the button to do it. It doesn't just stand out, like doesn't look like an obvious button. And opening it up, you have so much space back here. It fit all of our camera equipment and there's so much room even deeper down in there. Sitting inside the end line, there's really not a lot of differences compared to the last 2021 Elantra video that we did. So I would encourage you to click the card in the upper right corner to go check that out. Uh, but some of those differences are you'll get aluminum pedals. You have a little end badge right here in your steering wheel. You get an end line analog gauge cluster. You also get these nice leather and cloth combo sport seats that have the end badge um, right there as well. And they are bolstered um, to make them feel a little bit sportier and hold you in a little bit tighter. I also super duper, again, I love that they made this available in a manual. Obviously it is going to be cheaper than an automatic, but uh, I would just prefer it. You have a reverse lockout. It has a little N logo on the knob as well. Super like that. Some other things that really stand out to me, um, wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. You also have wireless charging, which is really nice to have. You do get heated seats. If you have an Android device, you can use the Hyundai digital key, or if um, you have Apple, you still have access to use um, Hyundai Blue Link, which will allow you to control your car remotely from your phone. So you can turn it off, turn it on, lock it, control the climate controls, cool stuff. You also have a series, a good series of driver's assistance, such as driver attention warning, forward safety, lane keep safety, blind spot, um, great parking assist. You even have a little um, a camera button right here in front of your shifter so you can quickly access your camera. All of these can also be easily turned off and are displayed right here in that analog gauge cluster. The Elantra N-Line has made it so that you can get a turbocharger, some cool exterior upgrades, as well as some pretty nice interior features for a super reasonable MSRP of around 25,000. And not to mention Hyundai has a bomb 10 year, 100,000 mile powertrain warranty. If you have any further questions, you can contact us at one of our two Hyundai locations in the Bay Area, or you can buy this Elantra N-Line 100% online with our no-brainer checkout at dgdg.com. Thanks.